<laughs> I shall be on my way now. It's okay. Let me see you. All right. Hey, mambo. It's been long you call your coming back. What happened? Bad road. Bad road. And I had little delay at the park. That's why. Okay. Where is my father? I need to see him. Calm down. Papa is inside. You want to go to the shiran and see him? Isn't the shiran? Yes. <laughs> Let's go inside first. Hello, hello, my bro. Aguna. <laughs> It is so, so, so good to see you. Wow, good to see you too. You see, the church business will work. I have the powers now. Honestly, my father gave me the powers. I tried it, it worked. I performed wonders and miracles. I want to start this job because it's just that I don't have money. And I did not want to collect from my father because um, you said you would sponsor it. Of course. I will sponsor it. But first, we need to do a whole lot of things. Okay. We need to get a lawyer, sign an agreement for the percentage. Hey, I know what you're thinking. <laughs> we are best friends. But this is business. Yeah? And you and I know that. The business. church business. It's business. Yes. <laughs> you and I know that church business is um, the most paying business in this country right now. <laughs> very, very creative. Not to worry, call your lawyer, invite him. If you bring any documents, I will sign because we are in for a big deal. <laughs> That's good to hear. Yes! <laughs> uh -huh. We need to get the um, estate managers, yeah. Because this church has to be on a very good site. You know, a good site to sell our business. Glory! Hey, hey, hey. I like Glory! It. On that <laughs> <laughs> Cheers to greater days. Yes. <laughs> wow. Um. So, Papa, what are you doing concerning my brother's way of life? <clears throat> Your brother Aguna. Yes, Papa. Aguna is a changed person now. <laughs> it's like they did not tell you. Papa. My brother is a changed person. How? Nobody told me anything. Well, well, he was there um, a few days ago. Don't mind. Your brother will tell you everything. Oh my word. <laughs> How did this happen? Hey, I'm only, shocked. Only God can tell. Um, by the way, how is school going? How are we coping? <sighs> <laughs> um, school is fine, Papa. And by the special grace of God, I will come out with flying colors. <laughs> I trust my daughter. Yes, Papa. Hmm? <laughs> oh my goodness. I wish your mother is here to see the success of her daughter. She has always been very proud of you. Yeah. It breaks my heart too. I miss her so much. I miss her too. But God knows the best. Hmm? It's fine, Papa. It's okay. Um, I will be going back to school tomorrow. Going back to school? Yes. Why then did you come home? 
to see my father, of course. I was missing you and decided to come see you. Is it a crime? <laughs> Papasi, don't worry. I'll be coming from time to time to see you, okay? It's okay. It's okay. Uh, that, that reminds me. How about that young man that is coming for your hand in marriage? <sighs> I'm not ready yet. I just want to be f through with everything concerning school before thinking about marriage. My daughter. <laughs> you remind me of your mother. May her soul rest in peace. Amen. My dear, I married your mother when she was 16. Honestly, just little oranges there. Papa. <laughs> <laughs> you know, your bro elder brother came when I was 18. You can see, if I go out with him, people think we are brothers. <laughs> people mistake us for brothers. While I'm his father, he's very young and healthy. <laughs> if I decide today to go out there to check chicks, they will run after me. There's know? no problem, Papa. <laughs> uh, what about your food? Should I get it for you now? I'm going to with this. Hello, Melu. Yes. I believe the agent can convince them to allow us to use the church. Uh -huh. But the problem would be members. How do we get members? The members are not a problem. We don't need much. At at most five people. And those five people will carry the good news of your miracles to the others. And then they flow in like water. But how do we get these five people? Simple. All you have to do is carry your Bible, go out to the marketplace or any public place, preach the gospel, do the miracles, raise the dead if there is any dead around. I'm sure you're capable of doing that. <laughs> Make the blind see again. I'm sure this is enough news for people to talk about and then dive into your church. Yeah, that sounds convincing. Okay then, that means tomorrow morning we'll take my time are you coming so can leave early. Oh, <laughs> no, 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 no. I could not. It's your job. You are the pastor, remember? Why, I'm just a financer. So it's your job. You expect me to walk into the street alone, preaching and healing people? How, how can I do that? I could not. I trust you. Okay? You have the powers. You are you are the man. You are the pastor of the people. Well, this is really quick. I trust you. I have faith that this will work. Of you, huh? I will always come to check on you. Okay? I don't mind, I'll be fine. Mommy. Papa. You know the family you are coming from. Of course, Papa. Please, do not engage yourself in immoral things in school. Papa. Don't join the court people. Do not kill. Our family forbids it. Hmm? Of course I My know. daughter, I shall do well with you. Amen. Papa, I've always promised you to be a nice girl. Hmm? So I'll always be a nice girl. <laughs> Thank you, Papa. Well. Ude, don't you see me walk? See you. Papa, please, now, let me have a walk with her. Please. I know you people are like twins. <laughs> Trust me, ensure you come back on time and pound that room. Yes. Ude, I'm talking to you. Come back on time. Papa, I will. I will. <laughs> I bring to you the word of salvation that ye shall know God and know him well because the Bible says 
No, no, I'm going to talk Jesus. So that is we here. That the word of God is a lamp upon my feet. That you shall know the light. And the light shall set you free. God is a lamp that if you have God you are made for life the devil has not been against you the devil cannot come close to you because you are a child of life I urge you to repent and give your life to Christ give your life to Jesus Christ go where they begin and think to me go where they begin Give your life to the one who has created you, the one who blesses you, the one who increases you. Aluminium. The word of God is a light. It's a lamp upon my feet. Upon my feet. And the Spirit of God has ministered to me that this blindness is not from birth. And it is not your making. It is from the pit of hell. But today, the God that I serve has come to set you free. And he has decreed that you shall see today. By the anointing bestowed on me and the unction of the Holy Spirit, I decree that you regain your sight this Amen. minute. In the mighty name of Jesus. <laughs> I wasn't just about calling you. Wow. I heard you did miracles. More miracles. You made a blind girl see. Clear and crystal clear. <laughs> wow! <laughs> <laughs> I shared handbills and people were rushing it. <laughs> handbills? Yes! The name of the church is captivating. Okay. So, uh, what was the name written on the handbill you shared? See for yourself. Final solution, Miracle Church of God. <laughs> Agunia. Agunia. Wow! We are in business. Big business. That's, that's just a wonderful name. I mean, it's so captivating. Yes. Where did you get this, this name? How did you come about it? I saw it in my dream and then I chose it. I, I don't know, but I 
I lost that in my dreams and I chose it. <laughs> <laughs> this is good business. Big business. <laughs> I do not know. I do not know. I do like this. <laughs> Let me get a drink. Please get please for me to celebrate. <laughs> wow. Hallelujah, somebody. Yeah. Praise to the name of the Lord. If you are in the city, say, uh huh, uh huh. Uh huh, uh huh. Uh -huh, uh -huh. The Spirit of the Lord is moving. And He will visit each one of you in your homes in Jesus' name. There shall be open doors. There shall be breakthroughs. They will be the I'm having this recurring dream about somebody chasing you and I want you to kill you. True or false? And the dream, of course, every other night, right? Yes, of course. That is some of the beats of hell. You are being attacked by somebody very close to you, a neighbor of yours, who wants you dead by all means. And if I do not pray for you, and you will end up six feet below. Come on, boy. Because you leave God, your daughter cannot be silenced. The devil cannot have victory over her. I Get that contract. Amen. Your adversaries shall fail. The, the contract it is worth a hundred million naira. Yes, my lord. Yes, it is out, out of it. The spirit has directed that you will sow the seed of their Jesus. As long as you abide by that, we shall be made. Do you believe that? Yes, my lord. Thank you. 
to happen. I am telling you, just in one service, we are raising money. <laughs> I'm gonna talk to me. What's what's going on? I prophesied for a certain man who is expecting a contract of a hundred million naira. He was in church. Called him out. He stood up, prayed for him, told him he was going to get the contract. What I told him. In fulfillment of that, he has to say thanks to God with 30% of that amount, which he agreed. Thirty percent of a hundred million naira. Thirty million naira. My gum. Cheers to the good life. We're in business. This was just in one service, so imagine when we have like two services in a Sunday or three, depends on how much you want to stretch it. My brother, my brother. make calls. What? Make calls. We need five women to massage you. Oh, no, no. Let's wait till the money breaks in our account. When it has landed in the account and breathing, we can import 20 Ethiopian girls to massage us. <laughs> I told you. I told you. What can you mean, good man? Hello, Papa. I just called you to say thank you. Papa, the powers are beginning to manifest. Could you believe that the other day I healed a blind girl along the road? Yes, I've actually made someone talk in the market. Miracles beyond me are happening and I cannot believe it. I just called to say thank you and to tell you that when next time in the village, we are going to that river to give our thanksgiving to us and wine. <laughs> thank you, Papa. <laughs> okay, I'll call you. I'll call you. Okay. All right. <laughs> The Lord is good all the time. <laughs> Come and take your place, O oh Lord. Come and take your place, O oh Lord, in my life. Come and take your place in my life. Come and take your mother of the rivers we have come today to seek your face as your son wants to pursue this contract he reposes all his trust in you that you shall give him victory we seek your grace we seek providence Joe come forward You shall have the contract. You will grow in leaps and bounds. Amen. You will multiply in manifolds. You will be bigger than all your peers. Amen. Amen. You will shine like a lone star in the skies. Amen. 
Amen. Amen. But you must promise something. At the end of it all, you must come back for Thanksgiving. Yes, man of God. I will surely come back for Thanksgiving. As far as this contract is given to me. Well with you. Amen. Queen of the rivers, we have done as you have said. It is now left for you to do as you have said. And we make that promise that when this is done, he shall return with thanksgiving. Do you affirm to that? Yes, I promise. I promise to return with thanksgiving as long as I get this contract. It is well with you. Amen. Amen. Holy Ghost by fire, by fire. Holy Ghost by fire, by fire. Holy Ghost by fire, oh by fire. Um, actually, I understand. I get. The type of land you want, and uh, already the area you want it. Exactly. Just a large expanse of land in that area. And then uh, somewhere that can accommodate a very huge church building and a uh, big space for car park. Yeah, I get you. I get you. And when exactly are you starting to work on the land? All I asked you to do is get me a piece of land. I want to start building a church. When I'm going to start building a business, just get me the lunch. Okay. Stella, you have 11 million naira in your account. You are chasing a contract of 200 million. Yes, man of God. You will have that contract. Amen. You will be a multi billionaire. The Lord of hosts has decreed it. When you are made, Everybody around you can know don't give Your ex-husband abandoned you and flee abroad. Now he's with a new wife. Because the Lord has established you. It is well with your soul. Amen. Today I decree 
the fullness and the manifestation of the blessings of God. Amen. 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 Sister Stella. Yes, man of God. I called you out here because the Holy Spirit ministered to me and gave me a message for you. Okay, man of God. The Holy Spirit has asked me to tell you that out of the 11 million naira in your account, you will fund the building of the new church with 10 million naira and watch him manifest his glory in your life. There's no problem, man of God. I am ready to sacrifice anything for God. Glory. Hallelujah. Glory. I see you moving around the length and breadth of this universe with private jets. Oh, thank you, Jesus. The Lord is about to make you a multi-billionaire. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. After today, you and I will go somewhere. We are going to have a time out for serious fasting and prayers. Okay, man of God. I will give you the details of that. Okay, man of God. Thank you very much. I'm very grateful, You're sir. You're welcome. God bless you, sir. May the Lord be with you. Amen. Thank you, sir. It is well with your soul. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Oh, oh. Brother well, Joe. Pastor, how are you? Pastor. You're welcome. Thank you. Do so have a seat. Thank you. Thank you. How is work? Uh, Pastor, everything is fine. As you can see. Good. Yes. Um, when you called, I thought you were close by. Uh, not really. I was actually leaving my house when I called you. Oh, okay. That's fine. God yeah. bless you. Thank you so much, Pastor. Um, Pastor, I really want to appreciate you for all your prayers and goodwill um, and I'm here to tell you that the contract you prayed for me for has been awarded to me glory <laughs> yes the yes. Lord's name be praised yes and um, just as I promised you that I will bring 30% of it here is a check of 30 million naira. wow thank you so much whoa the Lord is faithful. Of course, always faithful. Thank you for keeping your word to the Almighty. Of course, Pastor. This is just the beginning. Of course. Your Pastor. miracles are on the way. Amen. Amen. Open doors. Amen. More breaks. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much, Pastor. You're welcome, brother. This has proven to me that you are a true man of God. <laughs> yes. His words shall never fail. It is well with you. Amen. Amen. So, um, since the woman has paid for the land, all we have to do is use the money for the church building and other things. Let's keep our fingers crossed. More money will come. Yeah, that's a good idea. But I'm still suggesting we take 20 million out of the 30 that Brojo brought, put it into the church project, and then share the 10 million for now. You know, we need to take care of personal stuff. <laughs> You're right. We need we need some money to ourselves. Mm -hmm. right? The gods won't be angry if we have some you know, once in a while night parties. Party. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna call my girls. You know how it is now. Let's call them. Yeah, I'm doing that. As right a matter now. of fact, I need some massage. Church business is oh, not an easy business. Good business, bro. <laughs> oh. oh.
today to seek your face. Your son has come to seek success in his business and your daughter has come to ask for more. We know you can do it because you do it for my father. Come and hear their supplications. Everyone in me I know you can bless them. I know you can raise them. Let them be more. Let them be more. If I don't come on at the other one, I'll be more. Your requests have been met. You shall grow in leaps and bounds. None of your contemporaries can match your wealth. Remember to come back for Thanksgiving. Yes, man. Go with it.
against drink alcohol. <laughs> the Bible is not against drinking alcohol. It's just some pastors that use that to inculcate in their own doctrines. There's no way it's mentioned in the Bible, you know. From the first day you walked into my church, I took a liking to you. You're a very beautiful and decent woman. Honestly, I I hope we could be friends. I don't understand you, Pastor Agon. What don't you understand? I'm a human being. Irrespective of the fact that I'm a pastor, I still have blood flowing in my veins. And I have feelings too. I have a right to express those feelings, don't I? You have, for Good. sure. <laughs> so, can we be friends? No problem. Fine. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Are you sure you don't want to stay a little longer? All right. <laughs> <laughs> Enough, enough, it's okay. It's okay. Did you not remember when you were saying Hada Hada? Oh, Jesus Christ. Anyways, I need to go and check up the building sites now and know the progress of work. <coughs> then you have to drop me first. Okay, no problem. Let me get dressed. Ready? Papa! No more! Papa, where are you? <laughs> Papa, I have made money now. I'm seeing it all over you. <laughs> I am rich! It's written all over you. Now. I have bought a land, and very soon the completion of my church will be done. And I will start making miracles. <laughs> nah, Papa, I don't know. Where it all? Where it all? Where it all? It should go. I'm so happy to hear all this. Thank you, Papa. Thank you, Papa. Things are moving well. Yes. In fact, the ministry is moving. Things are manifesting. If you want, I will pray for you and I will deliver you from. <laughs> I can't deliver. <laughs> you know what? I am so happy that you are rich. And also happy. <laughs> thank you, Papa. And I have you to thank for that. You oh, make me who I am today. Oh, give look who I am, but not a gab go do Erika. No, come, 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 come. Hmm? If I had this word to show you, no. I'm alone. Okay, Lugi. Because you are the root of this manifestation. Hey, if I mean, he talking, he speaking, he talking about the room, man. Ah, 
no, no, para no, 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 nor seated in the seat of this conflict. The Bible admonishes us to be righteous. Choose your company wisely. Choose the people you hang around. Choose the people you spend your time with. For your company defines you, defines who you are, defines your values and the things you take to heart. The word of God is light and life and cannot lie. It cannot be changed. As it was in the beginning, it is now, and so shall it be forever. There is no going back. Every action has a consequence. Every gathering has its own purpose. Choose where you are found. Do not be found amongst the wicked and the evildoers. For he alone is life, and in him there is eternity. Right on. Therefore, brethren, I implore you today, to put on the armor of God and walk in the way of the righteous and walk in the way of the upright man for he alone is the beginning and the end who are you hanging around? what places do you visit? which places do you go? have you sat down to reflect? have you sat down to ponder? What do I achieve being around here? What do I gain being around here? That is what you should ask yourself. The Lord is not a liar and he can never lie. He said that heaven and earth will pass away, but his works shall never ever pass away. That is why he's God. Give Jesus a big hand! At this juncture, I shall call on Sister Evangelica to give us a powerful word before we are at the throne of the Lord this morning. Everybody rise to your feet as I walk into the congregation. Rise to your feet. Rise to your feet. It is a day of grace. It is a day of hope. It is a day of testimony. Queen of the rivers. As a wine in Mary. Your daughter has come to seek your face this time. Concerning a contract she's pursuing herself. I know you can do it for her. I'm a nigga, man. Like you have always done it for my father, you will do it for me. You will give her the blessing. She will have providence. It is done. That contract is automatically yours. As the one you merely have done. But you must promise to come back for Thanksgiving. Understood? You do? It is your word. I don't like the way you talk to me. What do you mean? I 
as if I don't care or I'm not capable of handling it. Are you what challenging me? What is wrong with you? Huh? Are you challenging me? Look, I am the wife of the owner of this church. You take orders from me. Really? Yes. I am one of the founders of this church. Well, there we are you when we are struggling to build this church. Even your husband cannot talk to me like this. You are very stupid, Stella. But only my husband went to this issue. When they make me see, how dare you? Really? I am, I am very stupid to have allowed you to head the women's unit. What is wrong with you? Oh, I see. Eh? <laughs> Respect yourself. Get out! Respect yourself. Get out! Respect yourself. Get out! Get out! Look, let her go. With or without her, this is time. Yes. Don't say that. What about your love? What about your love? Rubbish. What's all this? Sorry. Was Stella with you? At the inception of the church. Yes, why? Today at the women's meeting. I just told Stella to handle her unit well. Just because I felt that they're lagging behind. Mm -hmm. Could you imagine that Stella fled up and started insulting me? She said I insulted her. That in fact, she wouldn't have allowed me to be the women's group leader. She said that. <laughs> she even fled up and left the meeting. Oh my God, what has come over Stella? She wasn't always like this. Jealousy. Jealousy. Jealousy, why? Yes, because I sensed that in her tone while she was shouting. It's jealousy. Stella. Sister Stella, you should have accorded her some respect, knowing fully well that she's my wife. And she should have not insulted me in the presence of everyone. But the truth, your wife does not have respect and does not deserve any. I will not have you speak about my wife in that manner. Have you heard me? Then what will you do? What will you do, Agonna? If you try to mess up with me, I will expose you. What stupid thing did you just say? Stupid thing. Agonna, you said stupid. Who among us is stupid? A man who had been deceiving the church, using magic and ritual, a fake pastor. Who among us is a stupid one? Stella, you do not want to incur my wrath. Then if I do, what will you do? What will you do, uh, 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 Agunna? What will you do? Hmm? I will definitely expose you. And that's your wife will leave you as soon as she notices your secret. Fake man of God. I know how to deal with you. You want to kill me. Aguna, you want to kill me. But let me tell you something. Even if you succeed in killing me, you will definitely go with me. This life is full of mystery. Yeah. Be careful where you go for prayers. Be careful the places you go Since I had not known it, Aguna and his wife, strange things have been happening to me. I'll never keep quiet. I must talk. Even if I have to die, Aguna have to die with me. This envelope contains 100,000 naira and all the evidence. Should in case I got missing, this envelope will take you straight to my murderer and the cause of my disappearance. Don't open this envelope until I am no more. Madam, why don't you tell me who is after your life? And I will 
I and my boys will get the person arrested and make him to sign undertaking. No, it's my friend and I don't want to strike first. If he strikes me and kill me, even in my death, I will surely strike back. That's the reason for this letter. Madam, are you comfortable with these your decisions? I am, Inspector. Be careful where you go for prayers. And be careful the places you go, no, no. You so I use in the name of God. Stop the money from people. So I call in the name of God in vain. So I use in the name of God. For powers of miracle, so am I using the name of God? Oh no. Things they happen. Someone came here. Sir, I should give me this. Someone. Yes, sir. You don't know the person. I don't know the person. Human sides are so dangerous. They can do anything because of money. They are using the name of God to the city. They are using the name of God because of money. They are using the name of God in vain. Try anything. They are using the name of God to steal. Oh no, no. Open the gate now. Things they happen, Mama Kule Mama. Oh no, no, Mama Kule Mama. Things they happen, Mama Kule Mama. If Mama, I suggest we call Stella back. She's a good person, and you know she contributed a lot of money for the progress of this church. Call her back, please. Be cool. Yes, allow her to come back. We need her and I will help you too. Honestly, but if you don't want to call her back, I suggest you report to the pastor. He has the final say. Mama, no. She asked me. Don't bring her back. Home. Why? No. Think she has spiritual problems and she needs deliverance, mm. but she doesn't even want to accept it. Then you need to conduct deliverance for her. How do I do? Jesus! What is it? Bunny! What is it? Look at what Stella sent me. Oh my god! Oh my goodness! Funny, see, eh? So you've been sleeping with Stella? No, 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 no. Oh my God. Believe me, this happened many years ago, even before we got married. I don't know 
why she would unearth this to come and destroy our marriage now? So you've been sleeping with Stella? I have not. No been... wonder she's been insulting me. I mean, believe me, this happened before ah, we got oh. married. This was a long time ago. I've seen that that girl is evil and we're going to... I'm going to treat her accordingly. <sighs> believe me. Can you believe me, please? I'm sorry. I can't believe this. <laughs> please, please, honey, I... I am not fine. This is taking another dimension. Stella sent those pictures to my wife. Yes, I tried to lie about it, but she's mad at me already. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do, but I really need to see her. No, no. Don't do it yet, okay? Hang on. I want to see her with my eyes. I want to have a talk with her face to face. All right. Okay. Bye. Some are dangerous. Some people don't know what you think they are. Oh yeah. Uh huh. Uh huh. You need to see how beautiful you look here. This makeup is so nice. Oh, honey, you're so sweet. I'm going to post it on the internet. Really? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Uh -huh. mm. <laughs> you're making me blush. Keep I'm blushing. blushing. <laughs> you deserve it. You're my wife. <laughs> Wait, wow. it's not like I look at it. You see how? What? Oh, my oh. goodness. Mr. Abuna Ijebe and Mr. Koto Mayo. You are under arrest for the murder of Stella. You have the right to remain silent for whatever you say here or do will be used against you in the court of law. Stella? Is Stella dead? I'm just hearing this for the first time. Officers, I, I have not left this house since morning. Maybe you're mistaking me for someone else. Maybe, but you have to come with us to the station. Let's go. Move it right now. Let's go. Move it. Honey, yeah. don't worry, don't worry, I'll be back. Let's go, just okay. respect okay. yourself. Let's go. Okay. Tell him what is happening. Okay, I'll okay. 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 Can you, can you give me yes. the benefit of now? Oh, okay. Get away. Oh, okay. Papa? 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 Papa, please come. Papa, better answer, buddy. What is it? Papa. Okay. Hi. I got a call that Aguna was arrested. Hey, so Aguna. why did you go Aguna? Hey, arrested for what? Papa, they say it's murder case. Oh. No, no, no. That's no, no. not murder case. No, it's not possible. Hey. Aguna, my son, cannot kill. He cannot kill. He knows it. He cannot kill. We forbid this in this family and he knows it. Papa, how, do, how can you say so? Papa, remember the last time Aguna came back? He came back with too much money. And, hey, and shut up! Shut up! Hey. I know my son and I know what he does for a living. Aguna cannot kill. Aguna, my son, the one I know, cannot kill. They have accused my son of killing. 
I want to know. Answer me. Has my son actually killed? Uh. Uh. So he's been accused forcefully. I know my son. I know my son. He can never kill. He can never kill. I couldn't know my son can never kill. Dalonu Rinne. Hey! Ndiche. Chukwa kike eke nemgi. Ayangu na haba eke nemgi. So actually my son did not kill. What I will hear you know, Miss Saka, you know, to an army. What they would hear. For my God, Barista, what? Hold up, you mean a good night has been released. Now that's, that's, that's great news. Oh yes, it's, it's great news. You know, I've been waiting for you for over three months. Yes, no news. No, I like this one. I like this one. Uh, of course, I'll go see him right away. Thank you very much, Paris. Uh, you know you owe me one. I invited you for my wedding and you did not show up. <laughs> it's alright, it's alright. Uh, thank you very much for this great news. Okay. <sighs> My goodness, <is> out. <sighs> Things they happen, Mama Kulema. Oh no, no, who man such a so evil? They are doing a sort of things because of money. Who man such a so dangerous? They can do anything because of money. They are using the name of God to deceive people. They are using the name of God because of money. They are using the name of God in vain. They are using the name of God to steal. Oh no, no. Ah! <laughs> Where is your wife? What? Oh, sorry, you've not met in Meso before. That's Meso, my younger sister. She oh. just graduated. Good to know. <laughs> Meso, you're welcome. I see you came to see your brother, huh? <laughs> <laughs> okay then, later. I'm already telling one. <laughs> so, my wife went to the market. She says she wants to welcome me in a grand way. Ah. <sighs> I trust your wife now. Eh? I trust your wife. How is your wife? She's fine. I'm getting used to the <laughs> married man lifestyle. Welcome to the club. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. But unfortunately, she was not at home when I was coming. So, I'm here. There will always be time. I'm not going to see her soon, okay? Of course. And then, I it hurt me that I wasn't around at your wedding. <sighs> it's not a problem. The good thing there is that you're back. I'm free. Exactly. So we can have another wedding anytime we wish. You know. <laughs> but in the meantime, 
We're celebrating this return. Of course. Let me get a bottle of champagne. <laughs> I'm happy you are back. But the church is divided. Half of the church believe you killed Stella because of the picture. Although half believe you did not. But I want to tell you that Elumelu used that opportunity to amass well to himself while you are in detention. He bought mansions, cars and even got married. I know about that. I also know he paid the lawyer who handled my case. Even at that, the church will not see you the way they used to before the case, even Elumelu. So what do you suggest? You are a man of God. You are a miracle maker. I would suggest we leave this church and get another church. I believe before one year you will bounce back. Yeah. Think about it. If any man could ever, things they happen, Mama could ever. Oh no. I understand a lot of things have happened since I left. I learned that in my absence, you. You built yourself a house from the coffers of the church, got a new car, and got married. <laughs> Agnes, all the money I spent in doing all those things were my personal money, my sweat. I never touched a father from the church account. And as a matter of fact, the only money that was used from the church account was the money that was used to pay your lawyer for your case. Okay, that aside. I also learned some elders are against me, accusing me of actually killing Stella while others are in support in my defense. But that is okay. I know I still have the powers from God. I know I can still do wonders and make big money. I will get back into business. I have another plan. What plan exactly? I'm establishing my own church and I'm leaving this current one for you entirely. <laughs> you can't be serious. You can't be saying this. Huh? What do I know about pastoring a church? How do I go about it? No now. The plan was I financed the church while you passed on it. And it's an agreement. And she'll stand. So if you must build a new church, it should be owned by us. As it stands now, that agreement is nullified. With events um, that have happened currently, I don't think I would still want to be part of that agreement. In any case, I'm starting up my own church. You can go ahead and employ any pastor of your choice. I am not taking anything away from the church. I leave to you the structure, the members, the money, everything. I'm just opting out. Aguna, let me believe you do not understand business and agreement let me make it clear to you we had an agreement Aguna, that i financed the church while you passed on it as a matter of fact this is my idea it is my money i started this whole thing so you cannot leave you can't elumelu i do not owe you any obligation to be attached with you or to be your business partner for life. No, it's not written anywhere. I have told you what I intend to do, and that is establishing my own church. Stop me if you can. Aguna. Yeah, Aguna, don't, don't. What are you doing? Aguna! Aguna! I will not only stop you. You know who I am? Aguna! So evil, they are doing a sort of things because of money. Human sides are so dangerous, they can do anything because of money. A 
They are using the name of God to deceive people. They are using the name of God because of money. They are using the name of God in vain. They are using the name of God to steal. Oh no, no. So tell me, have you settled things with your friend Aguna yet? Aguna. I tried calling him twice, but he wouldn't take my calls. You know you guys have come a long way, darling. Please, try and settle things with him, okay? The truth is, I... I do not have a problem with Aguna. He can go ahead and open a new church, but... It must be a branch. And owned by the two of us. If you say so. Okay? Just take things easy. Alright? Come, let's go in. Come and freshen up. Let me make you something to eat, okay? Of course. <laughs> let's go. So, I employed you to take care of my security here. This is my new apartment. I'm staying here with my wife. It's a quiet area, all the same, but you never can tell who is your enemy and all of that. I got strong recommendations that you guys are very good at this job and I would want to count on that. Your work is to make sure that this compound is secure 247. There are CCTV cameras everywhere, you have access to it and um, the whole of the compound is in your care as regards security, protect it and um, be proactive if there's any threat. I'd also show you the interior and everywhere you need to know in this house. So let's go inside soon while I show you. Okay. Someone I called my friend. Someone I helped put food on his table. Someone I rescued from poverty. Thinks he has grown so big as to challenge me, Elumelu. That's impossible. But I do not want to underrate him. Because I know him very well. He is very dangerous. And that is why I have contracted you all. Because I have faith in you. We are with you boys. Sure, we are with you boys. Sure, we are with you He wants me dead. I want him dead first. He wants to kill me. But I will kill him first. I believe my trust in you all shall not be weaned. So drink up. We have a war to fight. I'm just coming from meeting Elumelu. And he threatened me. I told him about my intention of establishing my own church and he told me if I ever did that, that means both of us would own it. And if I went ahead with it without him, he was going to deal with me. No, you see. That man is something bad. You are a man of God. 
You shouldn't be of equal yoke with unbelievers. Yes! So it's is? high time we stop him before he stops us. My love, we are going to commit that sin and I know God will forgive us. Yes. So what do you suggest we do? I suggest we eliminate him or disable him. Hmm. Okay. You know it was a Lumelu that killed Stella. To save me. What? My love! So you went through all that humiliation because of a Lumelu? You went to prison for him. Ah, you see what I'm saying? Illuminati is not a good friend at all. Miso, oh, how are you? Fine. You're welcome. Thank you. Um. Brother, you don't look bright. Hope all is well. He is not good. Tell her the truth. What's your problem? Why are you trying to raise us where there is none? Miss, I don't mind her. I'm fine. I'm just exhausted. Where are you coming from? Oh, from that, my girlfriend's place. The one I told you we are into online business together. Oh, oh, okay then. Fine. You're welcome. Okay, brother. Let me quickly change into something else. All right then. Thank you. for the places you go. So my is the name of God, oh no I'm very sure that was Agunair. That was his fucking car. But he just messed with the wrong man. Because I'm going to teach him a lesson he will never forget. But boys, what if he wasn't the one? I'm very sure of what I saw. That was Agunair. I wonder why he strike first. When I'm the one who's supposed to send the warning message. But boys, we have to be sure. So I would not make a wrong target. I am very sure of what I saw. That was Agunai's car. I am very sure he was in that car. But I am going to teach him a lesson he will never forget. Protective charm. Did he see you or any of your boys? No. But I'm sure he knew it was me. How? My car, maybe. Oh no. Using that car was a mistake. Oh. Yeah, it really was a mistake, but I couldn't have thought he would survive this. It's okay. Relax. Let me get you a chill drink. <laughs> Alright. So you have a cold bath, okay? Alright. I'll be back. Ah. 
Hallo. Hallo. Ah, uh, it is it is Joe. Joe. Uh, it is one of the electricians that work with people over there. Um, sorry. I wanted to find out if um your guy was on seat, you know. <laughs> I, I, I want to discuss business with you. You know all these big men, they don't have time. Hmm? So I huh? uh, um it's it's um it's one of my boys that uh, worked there with you now. That that you give, that gave me your number. Uh, yes, yes. Oh Saturday. So, so, so you're telling me that he'll be there on Saturday? Okay, thank, thank you very much, thank you very much. <laughs> thank you, God bless you, God bless you, eh? Thank you. Of this business, he had no money. Okay. He begged his friend Elumelu to lend him money, mm -hmm. which I agreed. Okay. But he told my husband that whatever profit that comes out from that business, they will share it 50-50. Okay. My husband agreed. Okay. Not until he was detained. Mm -hmm. Elumelu now took all the profits and bought houses, bought cars, and even got married. Eh? With church money. When my husband, your brother, was released, mm -hmm. he found out what Elumelu did okay. and decided to open up another branch. Good. But Elumelu, the evil man, said even if he opened another branch, that they will still share the money 50 50. Is he mad? Can you imagine? Is he mad? Mm -hmm. For what? My husband said that can never be. Uh -huh. Now Elumelu wants to kill my husband. Wait, oh. he said he will kill my brother. Yes. He's stupid. He's the one that will die. See, let me tell you, he cannot do anything. I will tell my brother to report this matter to the police. My dear, Elumelu is an evil man. I don't know his plan. We need to be careful. In fact, hey. we need to be careful from now on. I am not scared one bit. He should do his worst. Now, I heard from a very rival source that. Ogun and I will be going into the side. Now, that. That's where we are going to strike. I want you all to get ready. We're moving out now. But boss, will he be going out with his securities? We should expect that. I lot that they are strong men too. Even if we will get them down. What's going on? Have you all grown cold feet all of a sudden? You're paranoid. Huh? No boss. But it's good you know the strength of your enemies. Well, they are nothing to worry about. Because they are just little and untrained boys. Now you all get ready. We move out now. Be careful the places you go now, now. Some are dangerous, some people don't know what you think they are. Oh, yeah. Some are using the name of God. Stopping money from people. Some are calling the name of God in vain. Some are using the name of God for powers and miracles. Some are using the name of God. Oh no. The set time 
was now. Aduna! Aduna! Aduna, come outside! I know you're in there! You think you can kill me? Huh? You think I do not know what you plan to do? Am I the one you came to see with this flamingos? My name is Aguna, the son of Ijele. Fuck you, Aguna! I said, fuck you! Aguna, I am going to kill you. Do you know who I am? I am Elubelu. I will swallow you alive. I promise you. There is no point ranting like a frenetic rabbit, bro. If you want to kill me, you know you'll try harder. I'm sure you know Ijele very well and what he's capable of. Is that what you have to say? That is what it is. Aguna, is this what you have to say? This is what it is. Very well then. Get him, boys! Get him! Get! Hey. This is your... Hey! Hey! Oh, I see. Aguna. So you got the police involved. Today is your lucky day. Glory. <laughs> Today is your lucky day. Uh -huh. But I promise you, uh -huh. I will get you. Uh -huh. Let's go, boys. <laughs> Come back here with your earthings. Ana ako yeri. Aguna. Ana ako yeri. You will die for me. Elumelu attacked my boys and I. He killed one of them and some workers. What? He did what? Honey, you need to keep Bible aside and kill this man. Yes, he's the cause of our problem. I will definitely kill that man. He has pushed me to the wall. I will give him a taste of his own poison. <laughs> So Elumelu had the guts to go to the church site and kill the workers. <clears> hmm. <throat> this is something else. Elumelu has touched the tiger's tail. Now he'll feel the pang of the tiger. <clears throat> yes. Now I catch him. Anamabia. Yes, hello. There's a smack. Good. Someone give me your number. I need a cleaner. I have a job for him. Ah, money. Money is not a problem. If he delivers, I will pay handsomely. Very well then, I will be waiting for the contact. Thank you. I be careful the places you go now, now. Some are dangerous, some people don't know what you think they are. Oh yeah. Some are using the name of God. Why are you calling this number? Aha, Aguna. Well, I just called to inform you that our war has been postponed. Reason? The detective is becoming too nosy. I do not want him to know that we are fighting each other. But as soon as his 
off our business, I promise you. I'll come for you. Yes. And I will kill you. And then complete that church building. Trust me. I will give a good speech at your burial. And I will make people love you even more in that. Now you listen to me. Let this be the last time you will call me on phone and speak such rubbish. I am Aguna, the son of Ijele. I am the miracle maker. The miracle worker. Okay? You cannot do anything. I know you have tried my life. You have made attempts at my life severally. But let me give you an advice. The next time you attempt to take my life, do not fail. Because I am coming after you and I will make you pay. Uh, well, I think you're forgetting something. I am Elu Melu. Agune Chemba. I will be waiting. <laughs> be careful the places you go now, now. Some are dangerous. Some people don't know what you think they are. Oh, yeah. Some are using the name of God. Stop the money from people. Vacation is well deserved. <laughs> so after we have gone and come back, we can now relax and start fresh. Yes. <laughs> mm -hmm. Let's be on our way so we get there on time. Okay. under arrest for murder of Mr. Melu and his bodyguards. Anything you say here will be used against you in the court of law. How? Move it. Let's go. Honey, don't worry. I'll call your lawyer. Please do. Okay. No, we shall meet Take in court. Let's go. Right Uma, excuse me. Let's go. Go, 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 go. 